What's up party people and the place to be? We're gonna do another old skiers challenge. It's a varial flip this week. So that might be a bit challenging for me since the last time I did a varial flip, this is what happened. Whoa, whoa, what's happening? Whoa, Where whoa, am I? Whoa, what happened? Relax. You've entered the realm of skateboard knowledge and in order to return, to a place where varial flips still remain, you must answer this. Who has the best varial flips? I need five! Wait, so you're telling me I just have to answer who has the best five varial flips and I can go back to my own reality? Yes, that is all that is required! All right, all right, I get the point here. Like, super crazy opera skateboard cat. So, we're going to start with Tim O'Connor, not only varial flip up, varial flip up after that at Love Park on the steps, those great ledges, that's one. But can you answer four? Next up, Brian Anderson. Yeah, right. Fakie Vario Flip, the nine stair. That's two. What's number three? Number three isn't my overall number one pick, but it's my favorite on the list. Chico Brené's Mouse. Oh, yes. Chico is a personal favorite of mine. But what about number four? Coming in at the second spot, number four that I'm listed, we're going Mike Carroll, modus operandi. Nolly barrel flip over the handrail, down the set of stairs. Ho, 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 Eddie. It looks like you've bested me this far, but I don't think you can do five. What is your one number one burial flip ever done? That's where you're wrong. Number one, Quim Caradona. New York, Brooklyn Bridge, Nolly off the bank, over the barrier with style. I mean, look at his hand when he lands it. Boom, like that. Best burial flip ever done. It's Nolly, it's perfect, it's over a barrier like this tall. It's at the Brooklyn Banks. New York from 95 to 97 is everything supreme and all those guys want to be now and they'll never get there. Oh, he did it. Five burial flips of a standing pedigree return to your reality. Welcome back to reality. But in all honesty, that slam freaked me out and um, I haven't done a burial flip. This is going to be kind of, um, man, I know I can do it, but I'm stressed about it because <laughs> that slam freaks me out. So anyways, uh, here we go. Honestly, didn't expect to land it that fast. So I'm gonna try to clean it up a little bit and then I'll try it switch. Oh, no way. Okay, so I just did a primo. I've landed two burial flips. I'm over it. So I'll try it switch now because I'm not gonna go through that fall again. Forget it. I've landed Primo three times total, twice on this switch barrel flip. Man, I'm over it. I just wanna land, I don't care how this switch barrel flip looks, I'm gonna stick it. And if I land it, it doesn't matter if I like, I don't care if like my, if like I'm taking a dump while I'm landing this switch barrel flip, I will count it. I will count that. I don't care. Like I just said, I don't care how that looks. I will take it because I am not trying that trick. That might be the last time I ever do it. I am definitely considering never doing that trick again. Thanks old skaters for uh, putting the challenge up and making me go way out of my comfort zone with that. Um, until next time, guys, I hope you're drinking water, putting on sunscreen and getting out there and skating. Even if you slam, I hope you're stretching, jumping rope, doing all that good stuff, taking care of your body and your mental health. Um, until next time.